What's up, ladies and gents? We got a surprise stream for you tonight. This is a brand new game that just came out today, I believe. It is called Call of the Sea. I actually wanted to stream this, but I've had like nothing but cyberpunk on my mind the past few days, so I do apologize for almost forgetting about this. Uh, this seems like to be a really fun game, and I don't want to ruin the surprise on how the game is. So we're going to jump in, we're going to take a look at it, and I'll show you like the first hour or so, so you can get a kind of a glimpse on it. This is a part of Xbox Game Pass, so if you do have um, Xbox Game Pass, you will be able to play this pretty much for free, and I, I just love the fact that you can do that. This is being played on the Xbox Series X, of course. And I'm just going to go ahead and make sure everything is set correctly. I don't want to explain how this game is, because I really feel like it'll... Uh, it'll be better if we kind of go if you guys go into a blind I know what it's about but I definitely want to want you guys to go in a little bit surprised yeah I was just I'm, I'm up because I'm so excited for cyberpunk that uh, I wanted to do something I wanted to talk with you all so that's what we're doing so let's go ahead and start up a new game and uh, let's get into it hopefully you guys enjoy we're gonna take a look a little bit of all of the sea today Again, this is on the Xbox Series X. I'm streaming this in 4K, 60 frames a second. No, what? What was that? What are those voices? Where am I? I hope everyone is doing good. Hopefully your families are safe and everybody out there is uh, having a good day, good night. Wherever you are in the world, thank you for being you and I've hopefully you're all safe. I think it's very important we get games like this to kind of break up the realism of I've games been sometimes. Here my entire life. I'm trapped in here. These stairs. I'm climbing these stairs again. I need to get out. The voices are calling me. I, I have to get it. I have to... Uh, uh, uh. Those horrible dreams again. I've had them repeatedly ever since my mother died and left me that music box and her will. Harry always said that old family heirloom had something to do with my family's strange disease. If the doctors won't give us an answer about your illness, I'll search for one myself, you said. And in that search, it seems you lost yourself. I don't think I'd ever... Pardon me, madam, but the island is in sight. We'll be lowering the boat in just a minute. Oh, uh, thank you so much, Captain Hodgson. I'll be right out. I'm already getting Bioshock Infinite. All right. Time to gather my this things. Game. So it's 1934. Ah, the amazing adventures of Nora Everhart, art teacher. So if you guys remember the game, little indie game that came out a few years ago called Firewatch. This is from those developers. So if you were a big fan of Firewatch, then this game is going to be right up your alley. Very story detective kind of mystery game, which I love these types of games. 
I received a mysterious package at my house. I stored all its contents in my locked suitcase. I received a mysterious package at my house. I stored all its contents in my locked suitcase. Oh my, I have the worst memory. I forgot the combination again. Thank goodness I always bring my journal with me to write things down. So my guess it would be 506. Right now it's open. This strange and sharp relic came in the package I received at home. Does it have ray tracing? Uh, I am not sure. I I'll be honest, I can't Harry really tell. Heart, my husband, my partner, and my dear old pal. A brass key with the letters CW engraved on it, and some enigmatic instructions. I saw this island in one of my unsettling dreams. I drew it as soon as I woke up. As far as it being available on PC, I am not sure. I believe it is because it is an Xbox Game Pass game, meaning that it would be on PC and it would be on Xbox. But do not quote me as I am not 100% for sure. I do know it's on Xbox at least. But you can take a look at it. The game looks great. Hopefully you guys are seeing the good quality. Uh, so she has a little something. She has a disease, I guess. Um, but that's pretty much all we know as of right now. Merveille de Mer du Sud. Marvels of the Southern Seas, I think. And I think the last... What? No, I see radio. <laughs> I love this song. What was I thinking when I brought all these dresses on this trip? Hmm. I think I've overpacked. I've still got to pack up a few more things. So I think probably once you put the gloves on, that's probably going to be it. It's a relief that I don't need it to walk anymore. It's not exactly a clawfoot tub, but you can't always get what you want. Rolling Stone said it best, right? Oh, I'd better cover up my hands before I leave the cabin. I wouldn't want anyone thinking I'm a circus freak. We're all set, madam. The motor boat is ready. Okay, Nora. From here on out, you're on your own. Yes, I will be playing Hitman 3 when it comes out. Of course, we're going to be streaming the heck out of that game. Lower the motor boat. Be careful with Mrs. Everhart's equipment, lads. We'll be back to pick you up in three days. I really hope you find your husband there now. I hope it too. I'll see you in three days then. But please be careful on that island. You know what the legends say about it. I'll take care. Thank you, Captain Hudson. Oh yeah, this is beautiful. Well, here I am. In the middle of the ocean after traveling across half the world. Just miles away from where my husband is supposed to be. So... You left a year ago to search for a cure for my affliction. Your letters kept me close to you, but suddenly they stopped coming. What happened, Opal? What did you find? 
but she's looking for her missing husband who had Whatever left was, to try to find a cure for the illness she has. crew and set sail from San Francisco to Tahiti, and from there to this place, an island in the middle of the Pacific that the locals refuse to even name. Everything is familiar. So familiar. As impossible as that may sound. Is this the island I dreamed about? This, this can't be a coincidence. Yeah, I'm playing it in HDR right now. Wow, it's really like, holy crap. Hello, my beautiful wife. Everybody say hello to Harley Q in the uh, comments. So you have a disease. Uh, your husband went to search for a cure, and he's been missing for a year. This is where you think he is. And protected with stakes to keep anybody from entering. Why? There's definitely something strange about this place. See if I can find any trace of you around here. I'll leave my things in the boat until I find somewhere to camp. Smooth as heck gameplay, though, that's for sure. I know it's just resonance, but I do love listening to the sea in them. Did you guys ever do that as a kid? Where you would take a seashell and you place it up to your ear? And you could hear the sea. It was always a wonderful thing to experience. So clearly someone has been here. A tent. So somebody was on this island recently. Well, that's a Vivo. A flute that the Polynesians play with their nose. I won't be playing that. Well, that's a Vivo. A miniature Va'a. A Polynesian outrigger canoe. Beautifully crafted, too. So you can tell what type of game this is. It's a mystery style of game where you're going to be finding clues, learning how to do certain things. A note written in French. I only understand two words. Ill and mort. Island and death. It must be a warning about the dangers of the island. This Hello, machete Lucas. is completely worn down. The blade is dull. Someone has been chopping down palm trees. A lot of them. Maybe to build something. This is how, in my opinion, I feel that uh, Sea of Thieves should have looked. Look at look at this. It looks so freaking beautiful. Maybe I should play Sea of Thieves on the Series X. Because I wonder if, because uh, they have done an update to it, so I'm pretty sure it probably looks even better than I remember. I feel quite good. I dare say I might even walk a little faster than usual. markings seem to represent the sea. I'll make a note of them in my journal. It might come in handy.
Lucas says he can translate that letter. All right. Let's bring out the letter that we just picked up. See if I can find it. Here, let me bring it. I think it's back over here, right? No, we actually... No, it's here. Okay. So let's... Uh, Lucas, you can translate this and tell us exactly what it says. All right, I'll leave it up there for a few seconds. And then once he uh, says what it is in the comments, I will... Uh, I'll let you know. It must be a warning about the dangers of the island. Looks like it opens from the other side. So what that is? These wooden figures are called Unu. This seems to be telling a story. I wonder if you're like meant to, to, to stare at something. I don't see anything light up, so. Yeah, I don't see anything we can do, so we're going to move on. Lucas says, We have profaned this island to find only death, was what the letter said. Thank you so much, Lucas. Offering of Mother of Pearl, quite valuable for the Polynesians. It may look peaceful, but clearly somebody wants to keep outsiders off this island. What a lovely flower offering. From what I've read, the Polynesians don't need doors. So why build such a big one? Oh, I see how this works. Well, that did something. So notice how it's missing the top. Mm, something's missing here. So we need to find said top. carving tool this box CW those are the initials on the brass key you're it just trying it. to find your husband so whoever sent me this key he was went missing here. you got this strange letter saying this is where he was so you've come to this island the whole purpose of him being gone was he was out looking for a um, 
a cure to what disease that you have, which is probably some type of form of leprosy or something similar to that. Okay, so this is like a clue of where you can find that. So you remember the one that we saw on the ground? I think there's a hidden thing this there. This is starting to look like a scavenger hunt. So if I were to read this... Oh, there's something else there. No, that's just a look. So if I were to read that correctly, this is what I think needs to happen. I need to go back over here. And it's in one of these. I'm not sure which one it's actually in. One of these little areas has like a little... Right there. Boom, son. Well, look what's hidden here. Like a glove. This may be the first time I trespass a private property. My childhood in Newburyport wasn't exactly the most thrilling thing. I bet you each area you go to has like a different type of puzzle you need to try to solve. This one could have something pertaining to... Uh, Candles. Is that... Harry? Harry, you were here. You were here and I found you, damn it. Where are you now? Where is everybody? Where did you and all your crew go? Lady Shannon? That name sounds familiar. I'd better check my journal. Lady Shannon. Since I took such a long walk, this fresh air is doing me wonders. Ooh, we got multiple directions the game is taking me. Take a look at this area first. I can feel the air is denser here in this mangrove swamp. Rays of sunlight shining through. Another symbol. All right, so maybe once you find all of the symbols, that could lead you to your next area or something to that effect. And I thought Colorado was too far from home when we moved there. Now that I've crossed half the world, I wouldn't mind crossing the other half. But I have to do it with you, old pal. One of those games where you don't really know where you're going. You're just trying to find every clue that you can along the way. Oh 
Oh my, this is so beautiful. <laughs> what were these birds called? Uh, lorikeets. Cole's lorikeets. Okay, so I'm on the opposite side of that entrance. Remember that door right there that we can go through? Wow, this game is beautiful. Remember, guys, this is on right now on Xbox Game Pass. If you have Game Pass, it is free. Play it to your heart's content. If you like m mysteries, then this definitely seems like the game for you. Now we've unlocked two of these. Remember, we've done that one. A shortcut. That's convenient. Wow. I'm just amazed at the beauty of this game. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we're all ready for Cyberpunk. That's all I could think about, really, the past few days. I'm sure you guys are the same as me. I wonder if there's a clue out here somewhere that I'm missing. See that? There we go. Gotta get it at the right angle, I guess. Okay. This looks like cargo from an earlier voyage, long before Harry's expedition. You have found the secret object. Nice. Look at me. And again, we don't have a rhyme or reason of what we're doing right now. It's just trying to locate our missing husband. I don't know if there's anything in this area that we need particularly to do. I haven't seen anything stand out to me as far as something that we can do in this area. Beautiful mountainous landscape. So many different ways to go. We did go down that path, I believe, already. Okay, we we'll probably got another little puzzle right a here. A mechanical bridge? That doesn't fit in with Polynesian traditions either. Okay, so this reminds me of those slot machines that Harry and I saw at the Atlantic City Pier, but a Polynesian version. Gotcha. 
You've got to figure out which one it is. So we need to figure out how we're going to do this. Do you see any clues? Now, the only thing I saw was that big area back there, but how do we know which ones of all of those to actually do? So let's look at our journal. We found three so far. Uh... Yes, they were on the posts that were stuck in the sand. I know that. So the sun equals those. Maybe the mountains equal the three mountains. The That's the water. So clearly that can tell us that we figured out three of them, right? We just don't know the order. That's what we need to figure out. So let me, let's go back there and we're going to see which ex uh, ones were actually there. Remember, we saw that one. And then when you turn around and you go down here. There's this one. That was the sun. Right? Come back over here. Then you have all of these. However, obviously all of them are not going to be something. Which ones can we actually interact with? There are lorikeet feathers scattered around this uni. I'll draw the symbol in my journal. Okay. So the question is, is that's not all of them. I think there was a total of five, right? So there should be one more. Right? At least that's what I'm look I'm thinking. So we have found four of them. So now we, do we need to figure out the order? Okay, this is back at the beginning. So there should be... Harry said that he would go to the end of the world to find a cure. And by the looks of it... He wasn't lying. We promised we'd never lie to each other from the moment we started dating, no matter how harsh the truth. All right, so that means there is one more we need to find or that I haven't uh, seen just quite yet. Yeah, because see, there's one, two, three, four, five here. 
So there's that one, that one, that one, and that one. But we don't know which order they're in. That's the thing. Okay, so let's let's look at it this way. If we read this, does that mean that's the order? So it's going to be that one on top followed by the sun. So mountains, then the sun. I'm just going off of this. I don't know if this is correct or not. So the mountains, the sun. We don't know what the third one is. Then the water, and then that. So that means this one has to be, it could be that one, or it could be that. Yeah, see, I don't know. We got, a, we got our first puzzle mystery to figure out, everybody. And I'm just basing this off of what the way that they're showing up there. If you guys have any inkling to what you think, let me know. As of right now, one, two, three, five. Yeah, so right now we don't know. There is a fifth one somewhere, so let's go and try to find it, I guess. Now... Remember, the first thing that we saw was the river one. That doesn't mean that's technically the first one. Oh, here was the fifth one. Right? This sort of pond is a Polynesian fishing technique. There we go. There's another symbol inside it. That should be it. Let's see. Let's go back and find out. Okay, so this should be it. Okay, so from what this is telling me, it's sun, birds, mountain, water, fish. All right, so sun, birds, I wonder which one was the birds, birds was that one. Uh, mountain, water, 
fish. That should be it, right? I am pressing the button, just so you guys know. So, sun, birds, mountain, water, fish. Sun, birds, mountain, water, fish, right? Sun, the three things. Then the birds, that one. Then the mountain, water, fish. Sun, birds, mountain, water, fish. This is right. Maybe you gotta press this button? I mean, I don't know. Maybe you gotta go down to the button. That's it. Okay, sorry, that was my bad. Well, I guess I hit the jackpot. That's my ticket across the river then. Nice. It didn't take us too long to figure it out. I just didn't realize it, that there was another thing you could go down into and actually press the button. We have completed chapter one. Yay! How long have I been walking? I've lost track of the time. Help us get to 100 likes, everybody, especially if you like the gameplay. Leave a like and let me know what you think of the game so far. Wow, what is this place? Again, this is Call of the Sea on the Xbox Series X. I better X. have a look around this abandoned village. Harry's crew might have stayed here. Okay, we'll just start... Ooh. This enormous stone slab looks like a mechanism to get up to the outcrop. Maybe something goes in this hole here. Hmm, something missing here. Yeah, definitely something's gonna go in that hole, so we just need to figure out what. Yes, and uh, all I can tell you about Cyberpunk is obviously tomorrow our stream is gonna start. It could be very early, and it could be around 7 p.m. The latest our stream is gonna start is 7 but it could be way, way earlier than that. So just stay on tuned for that. I already actually have the PC version, but that version's not available to play uh, until a hot expedition. 7 p.m. They set up camp here. But I might be able to play the Xbox version a little early, so I might do that. So just stay tuned tomorrow on my Discord so you guys know exactly what's going on. Bye, Oscar. Patiki, like something straight out of an adventure novel. Um, I don't think this is a pirate game of any sorts. It's like a murder. I wouldn't say it's a murder, but because I don't know yet. It's like a mystery. Like you're solving a mystery of finding your lost husband who disappeared a year ago, and you're kind of on his trail to find out exactly where he is. And then, you know, you're putting together all of the pieces. Could these tikis be some sort of guardians? A Polynesian man covered in tattoos. I'm not sure if he looks angry or scared. Well, what well? The guy doesn't want to be near the ruins. Why is he so afraid of that well?
I don't think it's a horror game. Uh oh, that one's not playing. It says. So now there you go. believe in magic, old pal? Each one of us and kept his, okay? Looks like some of the crew members didn't get along too well. A forbidden ritual? Fascinating. Let me record it. So, you said you've been on this island before. Yes. Some years ago. I made a rookie mistake. I did it from my fishing boat to go to what looked like a better spot, less than an hour, had gone. I went suddenly, my bar, my canoe overturned. And I got this lovely souvenir from that mistake. Heaven, what gave you that scar? It's not a what, but a who. I don't know. I didn't get a good look at it. But it seemed like a sea creature I never seen. Anyway. I was lucky enough to reach that white sand beach. The one where we landed on the island. A man came three days later and got me out of there. He brought me to the port of Papete without speaking a single word. Time passed and I promised myself that I would go on with my life and forget about this damn island. Why did you agree to return to the island then? I need to know what happened to me, to discover the truth. I don't know if you get me. Absolutely. Yeah, Spider-Man Miles Morales is its own game. I completed it on the spectacular mode, uh, my walkthroughs on the channel. It's very fun. I enjoyed it very immensely. Of course, I'm a huge Spider-Man fan, so... Where is the one that was out near this? They're composed of four pieces. Uh, poquito. I've never cared much for games of chance. This fella sounds pretty hot headed. Do some of my patented voices. I came to this godforsaken island for just a few days and it's almost been two weeks already of doing nothing. Is this rich jerk gonna open the hatch anytime soon? I'm gonna wait for Mr. Know-It-All again like I did with the elevator. You better let me handle this situation. We brought dynamite for a reason. <laughs> Should have been a voice actor. Blowing okay. an ancient hatch with dynamite sounds like a fool's errand to me. Also sounds like what I need to do, right? Probably something that's going to make me... Ooh, looks like someone didn't like you very much, Harry. I'm not sure what to expect on this island, but I hope I won't regret not having a gun. See, that's how you know it doesn't have ray tracing, or else you would see your reflection in that mirror. <laughs> Most likely. Nice comb. You told us to comb the desert, so we're combing the desert. Found anything yet? We ain't found she. I always have to quote Spaceballs every chance I get, but just, let's be honest. Who worries this much about their appearance in a place like this? Brilliantine! Come get your Brilliantine! 
$1.30. Come get your brilliantine. Do you want to look brilliant? Do you want to stir the ladies? Come on down and drink brilliantine. Can you imagine what life was like back then? The 30s? It's crazy to think about with the way life is now. Geesh. Oh boy. They were packing a lot of heat when they came to this island, but they took all the guns with them. Very neat. Quite a looker. A fashion model, maybe. To Roy, the best stuntman in Hollywood. Yours truly, Vivian. Mwah. Listen, darling. You'll never amount to a hill of beans on this crazy world. But frankly, I do give a damn. <laughs> Looks like this fellow was a real heartbreaker. Oh, Mr. Vanderbilt, you're so wonderful. His real name was... Costas? Yes. My name was Inigo Mantoya Costas. And I am a ladies' man. I have whatever they desire. Some people call me Costas Apostolou. I lived in Manchester Avenue, Los Angeles, California. And I am a ladies' man. See? Looks like it's about everything here, I'm thinking. A lot of stuff to look at. Alright, we got a path down here, so we'll take this one. Is that a hammer? Oh no, that's like a pickaxe. Oh, damn it. Someone on the expedition died. What a delicate piece of craftsmanship. He seems confused, as if he was having a hard time writing this down. They use the emblem as a headstone for Roy's grave. This one resembles a shark. So, okay, so that's probably going to be our next clues. I don't talk to you in cutscenes, of course not. Here's the dynamites. Did they use all the dynamite? There was the dynamite. Explosives. Looks dangerous. A farewell message from a friend. Greater mortar. I never thought that this expedition would cause anybody's death. Oh, hey, CJ. I'm sure Harry What's up, bud? How you doing, so man? Either. If he'd known this was going to happen, he'd never have come here. CJ's the man. You guys like uh, Hitman stuff, CJ. He's, he's the guy you want to go to as well. I'm sure once Hitman 3 comes out... Uh, you can expect some amazing things from uh, CJ's channel. I don't know about you, but I'm gonna be spending a lot of my time in Hitman 3 doing the VR. I just wanna, I wanna like do a full-on Silent Assassin walkthrough in VR. How cool would that be? You know, I think that's like one of the things I'm most excited for. Yeah, this is on Game Pass. You can actually play this right now. 
And uh, I'm uh, I'm digging it so far. It's if you like puzzles I and mysteries. I haven't been close to a grave since my mother's burial. Shortly after she died, my lovely Dalmatian spots, as Harry used to call them, appeared. We thought it was nothing at first. Uh, so far, it seems like it's worth it to me. But you know, every gamer is different. So that's the whole point. The whole purpose that I put these videos out here is to show you guys a little bit of the gameplay, so you can make that decision whether or not this game is going to be right for you. Right? That's that's what we do here. I'm sure I think this is leading us to probably using the dynamite for some reason. An amulet with a carved Marquesian cross. The symbol represents balance and protection. Look at this little fellow. Oh yeah, but it does look really nice. Why is this hammock so far from the rest of the campsite? That is a good question. Wow, just look the at this. The river cuts through that canyon. It doesn't look safe to cross. I wonder if you can, like, get a boat to go down there or something. Not sure. Hey, Scott, what's going on, bud? Oh, you sold your PS4? You know what? That's a, It's a shame that they're not... At least they haven't announced it. I mean, to my knowledge. I don't know if it's true or not. That they haven't announced the VR uh, to be, like, PC-wise. Because I think they must have had some type of deal with, um, with PlayStation if it's only going to be for PlayStation. Hopefully, it'll eventually come out for Steam or for uh, VR Oculus or, you know, whichever VR device you have on PC. It better. That's for sure. Yeah, because I haven't actually used my PSVR in, like, years. Um, so it'll be interesting to get it out again. Because I normally play VR on PC. Oh, I must have found the luxury huts. Pretty swanky. Okay, usually at every single time you have one of these, there is the... Um, little thing you can press on. I don't see it here yet. I've seen Harry keep even restaurant checks for bookkeeping. He would never tear up a piece of valuable information. Oh, you know what this is? I'm, I'm horrible at these things. Uh, Alright, so if we're going to start from the top... Let's start from the top right. So clearly... This would be the top, right? I guess it's going to be like right. So that would be the top. Then the next looks like it could be this. No, that's that's very yeah. That, that that looks right to me. I'm really really bad at these guys, so I'm just I'm warning. I'm just letting you all, you all know that I'm not very good at, at putting these other things together. Maybe maybe I don't know. That's a that's a tough call. No. It looks like that would fit. Uh, let's see what else. I want to need your guys' help on this one for sure. Uh, I, they don't, unfortunately, do, do they have VR for Alien Isolation? I don't remember if they do. If, if they do, why wasn't I told about it? I would have totally done it. I did the full, I did my full walkthrough on the hardest difficulty for Alien way back in the day, Alien Isolation. Um, but I haven't heard anything about the VR version. I mean, if, that, if that's true, that's, that would be awesome. So this has to be the bottom. Because it's a bottom piece. It's a straight, flat bottom piece. So that tells me this is the bottom. 
it tells me that this could also be part of the bottom in some way or form. Um, from what I'm looking at it, this could be the total bottom that would be like down here. Then you could go here and then these looks like that kind of lines up right there. Um, let's see. This would be the total left side. Probably somewhere along the lines of the middle. I don't think it... It doesn't look like it would fit there. Uh, could... It could very well fit... It looks like it would fit right there. Uh... Then that means this... No. Like I said, I'm pretty bad at this. This is definitely not my strong... Strong suit. Uh... Why does that just look weird when I put that together? I feel like it should fit. But it doesn't really fit. Uh, does it look like I'm making progress whatsoever? Okay, whoa, 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 I'm getting, I'm getting somewhere. Hold on, I'm gonna hit the wrong button. Um, okay, so... Now, there very well could be... No. Yeah, I'm just having a very, very tough time here. Uh, this... This could be a part of this one in some way. Like right around in there. Be like that. That looks like that's right. So we've got, we're getting a few, we're getting some, some places tied down here. But there's probably also some, some maybe that we're missing. It's hard to help because I am streaming this in 4K, which means that there is a huge delay. So we're like, I'm going to do a little test for you guys right now. I'm going to say now, and when I say now, I'll go one, two, three, and then I'll say now. When I say now, I want you to type in, the moment you hear me say the now, I want you to type in now, and then you will find out just how many seconds the delay is. All right, here we go. Get ready. One, two, three, now. Wow, 27 seconds. Does that tell you how far behind? Oh, because when you stream in 4K, it's very, very, very far behind. That's just kind of how streaming works at that point. So it's literally 27 seconds away. All right, let's 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 keep going. So I'm, I'll, I'll do my best here. Um, Okay, so maybe this? No, that doesn't fit either. No. Yeah, see, I'm very, very clueless on where this goes. I, I don't think this right here is lined up. This, this can't be lined up right here. 
Yeah, when you when you stream in 4K, if you want people to be able to watch the stream and have it be good quality, you have to create a long buffer. If you don't create the long buffer, then everybody is going to be buffering like every two seconds. So I create a 20 second buffer so that you guys get to watch smooth gameplay at very, very high bitrate. I'm streaming at 20 megabytes right now. That is huge for streaming. Twitch only allows you to do, what, six at the most? Whereas I'm streaming 20 megabytes in 4K, which is a lot. Uh, maybe this has something to do with this. For sure, yep. Okay, so we figured that out. Okay, so now we've got the bottom left page. I think I, f I, think I see it. Maybe. Could be there. Okay, that looks like I'm actually really getting somewhere. But what is that middle piece there? That's really confusing me. I don't know. Can you, like, turn things around, or... I have to, I figured I, I have... Let me look. It's being ripped out of something else. Let me, let me look around here real quick first. The parts of the tiki on this column seem movable. Okay. Let's see if there's any other clues that we can read. That Frank seems to feel guilty for whatever happened. I feel really bad for him. Oh, Green's here. Here we go. Considering how poorly Harry draws, this isn't half bad. More drawings. Well, that's okay. I can see that. Yeah, unfortunately, you can't rotate it. Look at him. Giddy as a schoolboy. Icor? Your straight edges are sides you've put the bottom on too early. Yeah, I know the straight edges are sides. I can clearly see that. That would be side. That would be side. Question is, are they... It's like this would be side... Uh, that would be obviously right side. Like, right there. Maybe all the way over. That could be... That could fit right there. That's what that tells me. Alright, so this tells me that I need to take this push it down push it down and this goes here no but then it does that no see how that just doesn't fit it kind of fits but it doesn't fit it makes me even more confused <laughs> You guys are horrible, I know. I'm really bad at puzzles, so... Um, let me let me look around the, the, the place again. Let me see if there's any other clues. You put together quite an expedition, Harry. And all just for little old me. Ooh, that's Where cool. did you get this strange device, Harry? What the bejesus? Jesus? 
Oh my gosh, I am so clueless right now. So there's that. Okay, uh... So how does this work? Does it do, like, wherever the thing is? I see what it does. Okay, so it just... It, op it opens that up. I am literally so confused right now. It's telling me the green. I can only do so many from what it looks like. You see how the meter on that side? You have to hit reset and everything goes away. Wow, okay, that is... I'm not really sure how this thingamajig works or what to do with it. My dear old pal, I know you won't ever read this letter, but I'm accustomed to writing you and it comforts me in this strange place. This island is riddled with secrets. So many secrets. But I'm not only talking about mechanisms and contraptions, Nora. I dare say that something on the island clouds one's judgment. Otherwise, I don't have an explanation for Roy's actions. The man was arrogant, impulsive, and a little cocky, but he was no fool. We weren't friends by any means, but he didn't deserve what happened. Nobody we may have made that. some progress in finding the cure for your illness, but at what price? Man, this game is I very interesting. I miss you so much, Nora. Harry. He may not say it explicitly, but Harry blames himself for Roy's death. I know him too well. And I miss you too, Harry. Jeepers! A stranded ship! Yeah, Something's but missing here. Something's missing here. This explains why the campsite is nearly abandoned. Yeah, I'll go back to it. I'm just trying to search for everything right now. Other planes of existence. That's bats. Okay, after a specific alignment, this device concentrates the resonance, wave spectrum, and optical impression. Observing the lens will affect the subject's penal gland. <laughs> what? Uh, allowing them to gaze into other planes of reality. <laughs> okay. Penal gland? Alright, well let's see if we can figure out this puzzle first. One step at a time. Someone said that they maybe saw something scrambled on the ground. This is a letter. What mess did you get into, Harry? Okay. So that's what that was. It wasn't, uh, 
It wasn't a piece to pick up. Now, you see this here, right? Remember what we've been picking up so far? Oh, okay. So if you look at this, probably is going to match this somehow, right? There's that. Okay, so I, I see this now. I see that's... Shark with his little fin. That looks like that would go there. Because that's definitely the shark's fin. Because the reason I say this is because deep as blue as my hat is like a shark's fin. Yep, I wouldn't did it. That still seems like that fits there. We just need to find the other side now. Let me see the other one. Uh, we found two of them so far, but there's another one. I think there's another one. I don't think we have them all. It seems like we've only found two of the three, which is why we're having a hard time figuring out which one goes in what, right? Because if you pay attention and you actually take a look, You'll see that this is one of them. That's one of them. The second one is that uh, the the one below, the shark one that was on the back of the um, uh, uh, the the gravestone, right? So there's got to be a third. There's a third one somewhere, and that is what's keeping us from really not being able to figure this one out just yet. That one clearly goes there. Um, that one's still suspect to me, but I think it's, I don't think that's correct. I don't think this one goes... Do you think it goes there? It looks like it would. The way I'm looking at it, it looks like it would. Yeah, that does go there. Okay. There's a piece you place in the center near the top that looks like a bottom left piece. I mean, something like down there. You see an octopus? I think this is a great puzzle. I am just very bad at these. Okay, so again, we, we've established a few things. Top piece has to be What could possibly go here, though? I'm not seeing... There we go. Alright, we're getting somewhere now, folks. Well, I can't move it over anymore because it's... Um I gotta move it up. So let's move this. Get some of this out of the way. Sorry, it's very weird to control. The way that they have the controls here is very, very weird. I'm just putting that out there. Uh, so let's move this up. Okay. So there's the left side of the piece. Um, 
Now what's gonna go below it? This is definitely not. It's gonna go right there. All right? So we've established that. Let's move this out of the way. Yeah, I don't like the way they did this. So LS selects or how do I put how do I put this? Let, let me let me explain. Uh, LS moves this around and then RS moves the actual one once you click on it. It's it could be a little confusing. So that goes there. In somewhere, folks. There. Alright, so we've got that piece. Which tells me, let's get this out of the way. I already know where that goes. Okay, let's get that out of the way. That has to go there. Look, Ma. I'm doing it, Ma. Look, Ma. And my mom said I'd never amount to anything. No, she never said Got it. All right, so let's take a look at it. Uh, different sea creatures connection with the tiki or the symbol important family symbols. All right, so let's take a look. So we've got we've got the order now. Um, Does that have anything to do with that or what? Shark. Huh. Yeah, we we got the puzzle solved. Now it's just trying to figure out. The how are we going to figure out this order? So maybe it's saying that it's, 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 it's one or the other. Well, let's say for instance, let's do this. Let's do the house on top. Followed by eyes. Well, they're all eyes. Uh, the eyes with the house in it. There. Followed by the mouth. Well, they're all mouth mouths with the green though. Well, they, there's two ones with green. I think it's that one. And then, last but not least, followed by that little weird. Tape. Hey, yeah, that's not it. Um, the sketching and the note writing for puzzles remind me of the Uncharted series. Yeah. So we just need to figure out what goes here. This is still, this will always remain my kryptonite for shizzle. Because there's, look at this, there's so many different options it could be. We found four of those things. So, all right, if we do the one with the, like, the king thing on the top, then the one with the green eyes. That's them. Then the closed mean mouth with the sharp teeth. And then that one. You see what I'm saying? Right there. That's the other one.
But that's not it either. So let me try the other one. So we got the one with the circles at the very top. There. Hold on. There. Circles. Green eyes with the weird thingy. That. Then the closed mouth. And then the thing at the bottom. That's not it either. Okay, so I'm thinking... Well, there's one more. Let's try the last one and then we'll go to the other area. So the last one we haven't tried is the one with the bullhorns at the very top. Okay, right there. Then the one with the nose and the two things underneath. With the G in the in the middle, right there. Then the open mouth with the tongue sticking out. And then that thing here. Yep. See, nothing there either. I tried all four of them. None of them worked. So... Let's see if we can not figure this thing out now. I'm guessing these are all clues to help us figure it out. The Harry of a heart I know would never have given up on this. Something must have happened that kept him from solving it. So Black there's a ooze in a telescope? Pieces on the ground. I threw it on the ground. Remember, there's something that belongs there. Something's missing here. But we don't know what it is, and we don't have it. Like I said, I'm still very confused by this thing. Lens aligner. Right, let's put it in the middle. Does it have something to do I'm not with? Not really sure how this thingamajig works, or what to do with it. You see the dots, right? It's. Do you guys see what this is at all? <laughs> the machine is what drove him mad. Do you see a pattern in this right here? <gasps> okay, wait. So maybe one of them lines up to where... All sides sh show all four of the things. Like say, okay, the one with the the head is the one with the two bottoms there. See, that lines up. Now see this one. That one. Followed by the green mouth. And that one at the bottom. That lines up. So they're all lining up right now. So that technically should be right. Considering how poorly Harry draws, this isn't half bad. Let me see if there's another clue over here.
it doesn't say. Yes, if you guys know the, uh, if you know the combination to this, tell me. I mean, that's the only spoiler I would allow here. Because I'm not seeing anything else. Use the telescope on the dots with the pattern. Hmm? Jeepers! A stranded ship! Use the telescope... I can't move this around at all. ...on the dots with the pattern. You could be right there. You mean there's like something there that does it? Yes, I'm at the machine now. So, I reset. But now, what do I need to do? Hey, thank you, Adam, so much. I appreciate it, bud. There's a telescope down on the paper on the table with the lens thing. I'm not really sure how this thingamajig works. Okay. Or what to do with it? But we need to figure out... Look for the patterns. Guys, I'm just, I'm not good at this kind of stuff. I really am not. I don't see the things that a lot of other people see. Not when it comes to this. I see the dot. I see one dot below, then I see a dot slightly higher and a little bit to the left. And then I see another dot a little bit above, more. I don't know if that means anything. Man, I just, I just don't see it. What I do see is this here. I look at this and it tells me the one on the top, the one with the three dots, the one where there's one on top, and there's one a little bit down and to the left, and then there's one a little bit down and to the right without the circle there. I feel like that would be it. But I don't know where on this map it should go. That's the thing. So let's say I moved here and we made a dot. Okay, that's probably going to need to go a little bit lower. Let's try right there. So two. There. Here, above, it would be something similar to that. That's what I'm seeing there, but obviously that's not right. This is just so... I'm not really sure how this thingamajig works, or what to do with it.
like it's slightly off. Yeah, see, I'm just, I'm not getting it, guys. I'm just not. Huh. I'm not really sure how this thingamajig works, or what to do with it. I mean, I don't feel too stupid, because the guy do, trying to do it, he couldn't even figure it out either. This guy here, in, in the world. <laughs> uh, because... All I see is, I see those three ones. The ones that don't have the, the little scratches through them, right? There's just the three dots at the very top middle of the page. I see those. The reason I, I'm paying attention to those is because that looks like the same pattern in that right there. And so that's why the, that pattern right there. Other than that, I'm just not seeing... There's something that we need to put in there, but what... Something's missing here. Maybe we need to find that? I'm not really sure how this thingamajig works. Uh, let me see here. Yeah, well, so What to I, do with it? I don't know which ones. None of these just make sense to me. Considering how poorly Harry draws, this isn't half bad. Interesting. I think I have all the puzzles I need for this one, but for whatever reason, it just doesn't do it. And then what was the point of doing this? The order of the symbols is important. Family symbols, different sea creatures, connection with each tiki. Yeah, I just, I, I don't, uh, I don't really see it, guys. It's kind of like this. Dude, this is what you'd have to do. You do this, and you keep them on this one right here, right? One, two, three, four. If that's not working, then you change this. can eventually get one right by doing this but it seems like i don't know yeah this is just above my this has got to be like the hardest puzzle i think i've ever experienced in my gaming career i'm just not made my, my wiring is not made for that i don't know maybe there's some clues i can Harry find out hated here. asking his parents for money to fund this expedition the everharts are a wealthy boston family quite old-fashioned they were never really pleased with his eldest marrying a middle-class girl. That's why he wanted to get away from them as soon as he could. Just like his siblings did after him. Look at this little fellow.
an amulet with a carved Marquesian cross. The symbol represents balance and protection. Well, maybe uh, Venetra, uh, maybe have figured that out. So I'll go back over there and I'll see if that works. You can guide me through that. But right now I'm just kind of looking to see if there's any other clues here of something that I may have missed. I didn't look up here. It's broken, but I might as well draw what I can see of it in my journal. Okay, that's just the the one. Remember, this is where we got this clue. some sort of Polynesian coat of arms. Is that an octopus? Hmm, something's missing inside that emblem. So now you believe in magic, old pal? Wow, I just don't think I'm going to figure this out. Not on my own. Usually I can figure something out. It might take me, you know, a little bit of time, but... Yeah, you were. Yeah, you did say it was an octopus before anyone else knew it was. Hmm, something missing here. Yeah, it's like all the clues are laid out for us. We're just not figuring it out. The thing corresponds with the order of the animals. Well, let's let's go up here and let's see. Cuz I have no idea. Um Well, the order of the animals is what? Shark would be third, so what's what what symbolizes the shark on the third one here? That. That would symbolize that, right? Is it is it one two three four? Or is it one two three four? How does it go across? Octopus, and then the fourth one, well. See, this is the part I just don't understand what these correspond with. Man, what a brain buster. The grave where I just was, there was a totem pole? Yeah, we got it. We got all four of the totem poles. And I'll go back to show you.
I already got this totem. Done. And we already know what this one is, if you remember. That's the shark. So that doesn't really help us out either. Can anyone else, no one else has a clue of to what this could be? I know I can't be the only one stumped here. I can't believe there's got to be someone else that's not stumped. I know there's a lot of you are smarter than me at puzzles out there. So someone, anyone, please chime in. Help me out here. I need it. I need it badly. This I, for the love of God, cannot figure it out. It's almost like you just got to keep doing this until you figure it out. I just don't know. Unfortunately, no one is really talking in the comments, so that makes it a little bit tough. Someone just, like, look it up real quick. I'm, the game's been out, so I'm sure someone's already figured out the puzzle. Help a brother out! Look it up! I hope there's no puzzles like this in Cyberpunk. ship. You're saying the ripped paper is the order of the totem. Oh, you meant, you meant this. But how do you figure out which one is which? I know, she's so surprised every single time. Don't get it. Alright, I'll go to this thing here. We'll start with this one then. So, uh, Pachangus, show us your expertise. Let's remember, it's 27 seconds between everything that you tell me and what I would do. So I'm here, I'm resetting, tell me what to do, and I won't do a thing until you do. Riveting gameplay.
not really sure how this thingamajig works, or what to do with it. Okay, what's the turtle? What do you mean turtle? Second level of the eyes corresponds to the shark totem pole eyes. Okay, maybe I'm maybe I'm maybe I'm seeing what you're saying here. Hold on. Hold on, what's on top of the- how do I know which one the turtle totem is? That's where I don't understand. What turtle totem? Which one of these is a turtle totem? How do you know which one is a turtle? That's what's got me so confused. And of course everyone is saying different things. The page with the four complete totems shows which section go where. Top is turtle, so just match up with on the top. Yeah, sorry. I'm just, I'm still so confused. Turtle, totem, hold on. Totems on the left page uh, are turtle, manta ray, shark, and octopus. So that's the turtle. I wish too. I mean, this is just, it's so weird for me to see what you guys are talking about. I just don't see it. Bottom left mouth. Well, that's not two. That would be... What? Okay, that's already there. Three tongue out, four crossed arms. What? I'm so confused. It's like you're saying different things. I'm just so confused. It's like everyone is saying different things that I have no clue. I'm trying to look at what Soldier is saying. Bottom left eyes. So that would be those eyes. You think I'm missing something and that's why we can't find it? Frost arms. There we go. Secret compartment. I don't know how you found that, but what the heck? Like, how does that even... How do you even find that? How did you guys even begin to comprehend what that is? I'm just... I'm not seeing the four different things on the right side. The octopus, the shark, 
the whatever. I'm not seeing that on the left side at all. I, I have no idea how you were able to get to that mystery. I don't get it. But you guys did. I'm just sorry for the people waiting. You'll have to... <laughs> it took a long time for you guys. What kind of stone is this? I've never seen any substance quite like it. It feels... Uh, disturbing. Alright, so we got the stone that's needed to do the thing. This appears to be the shrine of a Polynesian chieftain. Alright, we're not done yet because we still have the other one to figure out. Impressive work. Is that a fish pattern? Okay, so let's try to figure out this thing over here. What about this one? So biggest, smaller, small. That's what I'm seeing there. But like second to biggest. So if I'm following that, it's more like... Yeah, it's going to have to go down there. Does that look similar? Oh, that puzzle is for later. Well, there you Not go. Not really sure how this thingamajig works. All right, well, what to do with it? See, that's the thing. We always try to do things before we should, but you have no way of knowing. So let's insert this thing into the the hole. I'm so sorry that took so long. I just, I couldn't figure out. Maybe we just don't have the proper thing that we need in order to do that puzzle just yet. How, how is that possible? What fascinating technology. again. Skin alterations. Like... like the ones on my hands. Yeah, there's those dots things. The spot on my skin are moving, I can feel them. I can hear the voices at night. Music plays. Cripes! This man was splashed with that black liquid. Whoever took this picture must have a really cool head. Those spots look all too familiar. No, we can't play Cyberpunk yet. We can't play it until technically tomorrow. Um, you can actually play it 
They say it's a simultaneous release, but on console it's not. So New Zealand or Australia will be the first ones. And if you just do your little console region thing, then you're able to play it early. So there's a little tip for you. If you're getting it on a console, if you set your console region to New Zealand or Australia, you can play the game earlier than your normal time zone. Is this a picture of my hand? Erythrocytes. Hmm. Aren't those red blood cells? Heavens! He's losing his mind! Ugh. I can't stand the smell of medical equipment. It reminds me of my illness. I better not touch it. But given what happened, they shouldn't have either. Is this stone structure a hatch of some sort? Well then, I'm going down. Come on, Nora, deep breath. Is somebody whispering? Hello? Is anyone down here? Close to something here, Harry. Let me see if I can solve it. Well, this looks like another job by Handyman Harry. Maybe he heard the whispers too. Well, that was easy. This should save some time. So I'm guessing I have all of the clues then. Do I have all the clues? I don't remember picking anything up. What did I gain? I don't have... Go back? I must, I must have left something. I had to have left something. Something for the telescope, I think, is what we need. Yeah, I remember Mist way back in the day. Press these star shaped tiles. <laughs> oh, 
Okay. None of those are working, see? Is it calling to me? Were these eyes related to the ritual? I feel disoriented down here. Do they have two pupils? Another eye. Ah, uh, I hear whispering. I almost feel as if they're watching me. Are these ornamental? Or something else? <laughs> I hear it. I'd, I'd better draw it just in case. So that's it then? The whispering, it... it stopped. Was I imagining all that? What is this doing, though? I don't understand. Did I need to do anything with that? Did I already do it? I think there's another thing here that I didn't do. But there's something else here, right? Why, why are these buttons here? That's what I'm saying. There is something else here. So what is the order of these is my question. You see how they link to each other? That's later? Okay, I'm always doing things too early, I guess. See, the game doesn't, that's the only thing, is the game doesn't tell you when a certain puzzle is relevant now. So you could literally spend an hour there thinking, okay, it's time for me to to do this puzzle. But no, it's not time for you to do that puzzle yet. It doesn't, I don't know. I think it needs to tell you you're not ready for this one yet or something. All right. Okay, so this tells me... Down and then...
I would say that's a second. One, two, th that's a third one. There. So then up one and to the left. Right? That's right, right? So that's I1, if I'm looking at that correctly. So let's go for I2, middle, second, then the... V okay, so I think I got to go one. There's no dot. There's one dot, two dot, three dot. There's a total of three of them. One, two, three. Uh, so that one would be two. That one would be there, which would make That one be there like that. This is what I'm looking at. This is this is what it looks like to me. I'm just going by the uh, the dots here, and then I need to make one middle up. So middle. That's going to be a a one. No, that's going to be a two. One, two. Then directly above it's going to be one. One. And the last one is on the top far left one. And the highest one middle far right. That's what it looks like to me. Am I getting this right or what am I doing? I have no clue. There are three different eyes. I just did all three eyes. I put them all exactly where it says they should be. The left doesn't look right. You are right. They don't match up. And they should be matching up. Hmm. Okay, let me look at it here. All right, so there's one and two. One and two. I need to so that might, might need to be going over a little bit more. That one is two. You think top left could be too high? You're you're right, it could it is it is too high, that's what it was. Now 
That's definitely a one. What do you guys think? Does that look right? I mean, it... No, the one in the middle needs to be at the at the highest. Got it. Yes, I think I solved it. I wonder what I might be able to see with this lens. It fits. that I saw. What were those stars? Okay, what now then? <gasps> That's the clue. My okay. God. What? What was that that I saw? What were those stars? That's the clue down to this area. You see how it goes back and forth? That would really confuse someone playing this for the first time without an audience. They would be like, why can I do this thing right here, you know? We did finally get it though. Hey, we did it. That's all that matters. It's, uh, it's figuring it out eventually. Now we just need to uh, solve this little puzzle here. All right, so we start on the left. Let me go to there, there, down, around, around, around. There's those two. Notice how that's a big sun. The biggest sun to me... Do you see what I'm saying? Let me reset this. Am I starting here? Start from the sun symbol, that's... Uh... Which means it would look something like this. can't start from there. 
You can't, it won't let you start from there. See? So you can, it, you cannot be starting from there. It will not let you start from the sun. So maybe you have to end there and you have to start from over here. So let me get in the correct position again. It's the other dots that are making it very confusing for me. One of the star buttons is still down. Oh, I see it. That's the end, guys. We just oh, killed no. ourselves. <laughs> wow, that was a tough chapter. What is this? Where am I? Am I dreaming again? This is different. It isn't my recurring dream. I can't stop walking. My legs aren't responding. Holy Moses, what... What is that creature on the horizon? Looks like my second wife. I kid, I kid. But seriously, probably. Not. Wait a moment. I no, no, no! Ah! I, I can breathe underwater. I have to get back. I, I have to find. What is that? What kind of creature is this? I need to get a closer look. Whoa, what the? <gasps> okay, this story is really cool. this speech. Oh, I have a terrible headache. All right, I can just go ahead and tell you that if, this seems like a really, really fun, even though it's killing me with the puzzles, this does seem like it's a very, that very fun game. Torn apart and cast so far up the beach. What on earth could have happened? Like 
they took items from the stranded ship. It's too dark to see anything inside the tents. I should find a way to turn these lights on. Oh dear, this dock was a certifiable loon. These medical tools are hair-raising. I'm glad you stayed by his side, whoever you are. Looks like Frank wanted to leave, but I don't know if Harry ever read this letter. Oh yeah, which is why I'm so excited for Cyberpunk, because uh, we're going to have so much fun playing These that tomorrow. These two fellows seem to get along pretty well. These two fellows seem to get along pretty well. Need to be turned on. Hmm. It might need to be turned on. Wow! Look at the size of these stones. Hmm. These symbols are linked to the piano keys. never seen Harry so angry. You always did have a good ear, Harry. How can someone build something like this out of stone? Is this the island from Lost? Well, clearly you can't do anything unless you have the, um, now we're turned on. Did he take some amulets from the other campsite? Or did... Someone took notes about some important dates. Pulp magazine. I love Chandra Hogarth stories. A portable typewriter. Photographic film. I believe Harry visited this exposition when he was looking for answers for my illness. So, uh, is, is this recording? Mm-hmm. <laughs> well, my God. shouldn't we be listening to something, Frank? Look at his contorted Frank? face. Is this, this what's assembled. going to happen to me? Why? So it should be fixed, Mr. Everhart. I don't know. Maybe it was never Those meant to footprints play. definitely do not look human. Where have you been this whole time? This picture is taken from a distance. What is he doing? Get off me, you lunatic! Hold him! Hold him for Christ's sake! Call the road, quick! He's repairing.
wearing my old music box. I don't know. She's got some type of um, skin infection, like what leprosy or something. Ship? At least that's what it looks like to me, but I don't know the full story, obviously. The expedition only has five members now. Few jagged rocks couldn't have caused a gash of this size. Oh, this place gives me the creeps. See any trace of the ship's crew, nor their remains. Hmm. No power. This isn't right. No, wrong. I'll try again. Recording. Unaccounted for. Five of us have survived, but we're stranded on this island. Please send help. Hmm. The ship was whaling not far from here. This is a distress call from Even the crew of the ship that brought Harry's expedition to this island were afraid of it. The Lady Shannon has run aground. Its crew. Hmm. This is the captain's last entry. Frank is certainly a resourceful man. Yeah, that doesn't seem smart to me either. <laughs> what were you looking for in the heart of the island? Maybe the legend is more real than it seems. And I was completely covered in that black goo. I wonder what it'll do to me. The black ooze's properties are perplexing. These knobs must control the vibrations inside this chamber. numbers in my journal. I have no idea what the heck I just did, but I did it. This is a distress call from the Everhart Expedition. 74 nautical miles east of Tahiti. This is a distress call from the Everhart Expedition. 74 nautical miles east of Tahiti. The Lady Shannon 
cannon has run aground. Its crew is unaccounted for. So five of us have survived, but we're stranded on this Apparently, island. Apparently, Harry's expedition Please waited for a long time to be rescued. Did they give up hope? I don't see anything else for me to grab here. Please send help immediately. This is a distress call from the Everhart Expedition. 74 nautical miles east of Tahiti. The Lady Shannon has run aground. It's crew. Only God knows how long I've been covered in this black liquid. I wonder what it's going to do to me. Although I doubt anything could be worse than my illness. kind of improvised workshop. This must be the highest part of the island. And that diamond shape again. You made it work, Harry. Now it's my turn. So this is the reason the ship was scavenged. What kind of machine were you building? Blowtorch. Looks like it's been used a lot. Harry isn't usually very chummy, but he really seems to like Frank. I've been interested in knowing how things work since I was a child, but I always thought technology wasn't for me. What nonsense.
Yeah, this is pretty interesting. I mean, there's so much to uncover and... That huge stone door looks like an exit. How does it open? This ornate structure certainly isn't natural, but not man-made either. Uh, this feels ominous. Would this be considered the well? Okay, I see that now. instructions to operate this bizarre structure. This is fascinating. Those symbols seem to indicate the height of the tide. This is like a complete and total mystery. So if I'm reading this correctly, one, two, three, four. How do you know which one is supposed to be on what, though? That's the only thing that's got me confused, is I'm not sure which one is supposed to be on what. You can see all the marks, though. Okay, so... If I'm reading this right, two is fine, one is not. Four is not. So, like I said, if I'm reading it right, then it would be this. So, th so one, three, 
down in the four. Two more left. Uh, straight down, three and four. seen one yet. Oh yeah, I'm sure there's a lot of things that I've probably missed. There's another one here. Where is the final one? There's literally only one left. See? It's the one that's straight down. There's gotta be one that I'm missing. Yeah, does anyone see what that last one is? I don't see it. Oh, is that it? Yeah, see, that didn't do anything. Gotcha! That's the difference between black and white, and it tells you what it needs to be. So one is white, two is black, three is black. One is white, two is black, three is black. Okay, so one, all right, so as of right now, all of them are on black. Uh, hold on a sec, my eye is here. Why do I need to check that? I mean, that's, that's, the puzzle I'm trying to do is uh, is what you see here. You see me here trying to do. So let's see. Uh, which one's that one? That one's the cross. It is black.
black needs to be shown. Okay. We go to this one. This is number three. It is black needs to be showing. This one is that one. That's going to be white. Well, let me do this first, and then if I see that I need to go over there, then I'll do that. Okay. Alright, this is one. One is white. Yep. So, one, four, and the sideways are white. One. Two is black, yep. One, four, sideways are white. Okay, so two, three, down, and cross are black. Two, three, down, and cross are black, so yes. All right, so I need to go. You're telling me I need to go back down there. Let me find out what this is. Go back to the tent with the slideshow with the sea levels. I'm quite scared of storms. When I was a child, I used to cover myself with the sheets to not listen to the noise of thunder. I honestly doubt I'd like to cover myself with anything in here. Time to overcome my fears, I guess. This tent? What kind of machine were you building? What was it at the end of that different one? Photographic film. Those lights are not on, see? Well, what's keeping these lights from being on? Here's the one. I 
hope you didn't borrow this slide projector from the University of Denver, old pal. So you're telling me that this one is this? Okay, so what what am I supposed to do? I think this is the right one. Oh. What? One is four. Oh, okay. I, I see that. What kind of doodad is this? Well tuned. I expected no less from you, old pal. I think I did it right. I don't know if I did that right or not. Captain Hodgson told me that knowing the lunar cycles is useful for better navigation at night. So, Harry probably took this calendar from the Lady Shannon. Oh my god, this is just too much puzzlery for me right now. You have got to be crapping me. What's today's date, though? Oh my god, I'm just so freaking... Oh, my mind! You always did have a good ear, Harry. How can someone build something like this out of stone? All right, let's go back over there. I, I've never seen Harry so angry. Whether this isn't just some ghastly dream. It's curious, but it's the first time since I got sick that I feel useful. Harry is depending on me, and not the other way around. Odd structure. It doesn't look like a building, though. What odd? 
odd structure. It doesn't look like a building, though. I'm assuming I am done with all of that. And then we can do this part. This this game has wow man, they have just whew, the puzzles are something. Start with this one. So what this says is that if it is number one, which is supposed to be white, number one is number four. So number, I'm sorry, number one is, hold on, what is this one? This one's number one. So then number one is whatever the down and up one is. And that's white. So that's right. Number two. Number two is going to be the left and right. Left and right is black. That's right. A left and right. Left and right is supposed to be number two. Number two is black. That's right. Four. Four is supposed to be number one. And number one is white. That's right. See, this has got me even more confused. Everything is right so far. Okay, cross. Cross is supposed to be number four. And number four is white. Right? Yeah, number four. No, four is black. I'm so confused. Number three. Three turns into the four crosses, those, which is black. Yeah. I don't know how I'm supposed to read this. I, d I don't know how I'm supposed to read this. I don't know. Am I not reading it right? What do you guys think? Give me a second here.
I just don't get this. This is so confusing. Let me... Let me take a look at this real quick. If anyone else knows how do you think that you would be able to do this, by all means, let me know. I'm trying to figure this out myself. Because of the full moon. We have an open position, so turn it to close.
Wow, it took you about two hours? Well, that one, the organ wasn't too difficult, though. I mean, I didn't know to go over to the... I didn't know there was an organ there. Now, I definitely needed your help on that. But that may have taken me a long time without you telling me there's an organ there. Because I didn't see the organ because it was dark and I didn't go back over there. My dear old pal, I think I'm getting closer to understanding what is happening to you. But it is taking a toll on my sanity. As fascinating as this island and its ancient and unfathomable wonders may seem, it's also a place plagued with misfortune and calamities. We lost Roy at the camp site. We almost lost our engineer on this beach. The doctor went mad and stabbed him with a strange knife. And all because of this island, Nora. Initially, we were optimistic and in high spirits, but now we've all become resentful and discouraged. Even I can feel how I am constantly assaulted by dark thoughts. Anyway, if what I am going through here helps me find you a cure, it'll have been worth it. I hope to find an answer in the temple on that mountain peak. Love you always. Harry. My poor Harry. He is worried, exhausted, disheartened. I will find you, my love. Sorry, but don't believe Vines if you're in the chat. You'd never believe someone when they just say something like that. Especially when they put a link. I, I would not believe that. Listen, if you guys ever want to know sure if an Xbox or PlayStation 5 is in... Dangerous. Stockinformer.com. That will tell you. That is all you need to know. That was a pretty interesting, uh, some pretty interesting puzzles. Stock Informer will always tell you when a new stock of something comes in. Uh, Xbox, PlayStation, um, and all that kind of stuff, so. Alright guys, well that's going to be it for tonight. I need to get some sleep because Cyberpunk is coming. So I need to be ready because we are going to be streaming pretty much the next few days non-stop so hopefully you all will be ready for that I'm going to have lots of guides and lots of videos and whatnot for Cyberpunk coming up very soon I hope you guys enjoyed this stream, thank you all for tuning in, I wasn't even expecting to go this long but the game was actually quite fun and I recommend, if you have Game Pass get this game as it's pretty fun I actually really enjoyed myself hopefully you guys did too uh, thank you so much for watching, I love you all um, hope you stay safe and I will see you on the next one. Lots of great things coming up soon. Peace.